Well, hello, Lionhearts. It's your old pal, Jordan the Lion, and where I'm starting this video today is back at my grandpa's house in Ohio. The reason we're doing this is because this vlog could not be done in one day. Uh, for Christmas, uh, my mom said, what would you like? And I said, for Christmas this year, I want to get a genealogy kit for Jaw. So she got us one. We're going to do the swab and everything that you have to do for it here. And then we're going to mail it off. And at the end of this video, I should have received it in Los Angeles. And we'll find out exactly the big question everybody always asks. What breed is Jaw? Days with Jordan the Lion begins now. This is not a paid advertisement, but this is what we're using. So, you know, this is the, uh, if you want to find out everything that they test for and all that, right now it says test for 350 plus breeds, types, and varieties. Screens for a multi-drug sensitivity. The world's leading canine DNA test. Sounds good. Now it looks like you collect your dog's DNA. My mom said she thought that, since I haven't really opened it yet, she thinks that you just swab the mouth. You activate online, mail the test, and receive the report. So... Let's go find Ja. So it's funny that this bedroom that I stay in when I'm here visiting is the same bedroom that my aunt and mother grew up in. My mom had that bed right over there and my aunt had that bed. And then my uncle lived up here when they moved out. And then I moved up here when I became an adult, when I turned 18 for about six months before I moved to Hollywood. All this time they've had twin beds and I finally convinced my grandpa to get rid of one of the beds and put a full-size bed in here for his full-size grandson. All right, so it looks like we've got a little swab in there, and she was right. You do uh, open up the swab, roll it around between his cheek and his gums for about 15 seconds, and then put the handles into this little carton right here in these little holes. And uh, I guess you do it for all the swabs, and you do all swabs for one pet. Okay. Let's give it a try, Jaw. All right, here we go. We're peeling it open. Ooh. And Jaw is right at my feet. All right, Jaw, we gotta stick these swabs in your mouth, okay? Open your choppers. Good boy, that's one down, one more. Let me shove it in the mouth. Open your mouth. There you go. Let's try this side. Open your mouth. Here. We're almost done. We're almost done. Open. Come up, please, Jaw. Please. Hey. Hey. You didn't care for that, but you done good. I appreciate it, Jaw. We all need to know what you are so everybody can get one just like you. All right, believe it or not, we got it. Jaw was not a fan of having these things stuck in his mouth and rolled around his cheek, but that's what you got to do. So we're going to put those two swabs in that little sealer or that little envelope again, put them all in here, and then mail this sucker out. And it says they should have the results within two to three weeks of receiving it. So, you guys will see this, well, in the snap of a finger, but it'll actually be a couple of weeks. All right, well, it's our last day in Texas. You've already seen how this all started. Now, we got the results the day before we take off from Waco. So let's see what the deal is with Jaw. What breed is Jaw? Or breeds? All right, Ja, you know, everybody wants one of you. Everybody thinks somehow there's a way to get a clone of you, so they all want to know what breed is Ja. Well, they sent back the test results, and let's check it out. Right here on my phone, it says that Ja is 50% Chihuahua, 12.5% Miniature Pincher, 12.5% Pug, and then 25% of him looks like that's the Jack Russell part that I've always thought of. The sporting terrier, companion, and herding. So that's the story with Jaw. Sorry, we bored you to death. Now everybody can find one of you. 
Now we know why you've got the little curly tail, the little pug tail. You're part uh, miniature pincher, chihuahua, Jack Russell, and pug. And crier. All right, everybody, I hope that summed up the story with Jaw for you. All right, my friends, we're gonna call it a day. Thank you, John Roberts, Jeanette Thibodeau, Rita Rizzo, Mason Murray, Susan Friend, Linda Kinney, and Lori Hutchinson for making contributions to my channel. We'll see you all in Los Angeles again later. Goodbye.